Hi everybody and welcome to my first YouTube video. This is my first time posting on my channel. I've had it for a while but I did not post anything because I wasn't too sure if I wanted to start this and when I decided I finally wanted to start it, I just kept on procrastinating. I said, I'm going to start in January, I'm going to start. And then I look at the calendar, it's February. I said, you know what, I might as well just start with this with all I have, a phone, you know, like... I said, I'm going to start with this, you know, and see how far I go with it. So, you know, maybe I can throw in a little bit more things. But, like I said, I'm so excited. And thank you so much to my new subscribers. I had put it out on Instagram a few weeks back. And, you know, I had like 11 subscribers. You know, thank you so much for everyone who supported me. And if it's your first time bumping across my channel, please hit the subscribe button right now. And... You know, I promise you it's going to be good. It's going to have all the good stuff. I'm going to do makeup tutorials. I'm going to do hair and a lot of hair because I love hair. I'm just always getting hair and, you know, it's a problem I need to, you know, kind of like turn down with. So I'm going to have a lot of, you know, hair reviews. You know, I'm going to show you which companies I buy my hair from. You know, I'm going to do try on hauls, makeup, you know, I'm going to do some advice, some motivation as well. So it's going to be good. So just please show your girl some love and hit the subscribe button and, you know, just start with me. Okay, guys, so you really need to forgive me for my horrible editing skills, but I just didn't know where to put this. It wasn't allowing me to put it. I don't know if I was using the right app. But anyway, that's the week that I purchased. I just wanted you guys to see from the app so you know what I'm talking about. So today in my first video, I decided I'm going to review this hair that I purchased from Sam's Beauty. And this is called Trisa. Um, Right now, unfortunately, I don't have the packaging because I have this. I've had this like wait for two months and I trashed it out already. So, you know, I want to see if I can put it on the side or in the video. So you guys know what I'm talking about. Um, But if you come on a youtube a lot you probably seen a lot of hair reviews you know for this specific wig so i just wore it on the side because on the model it was like right here and it was a green wig so yeah it was right here and i do sometimes wear it in the middle if i feel like but you know some days i just want to have this because this is just like sort of a me kind of look so yeah i always prefer wearing it on the side and I decided to um, show you guys how it looks like this on the side. So yeah, this week was $23. And with the shipping and the taxes and all that stuff, it came up to about $36. So yeah, I got this week for $36. And I got it in shade number one. So it's synthetic hair. And it's pretty long. It's like, I would say 24, 26. Yeah, but it's pretty long and, you know, it's almost like right above my back crack. So, yeah, it's a long wig and it is really bulky and I love big hair. So, this just gives me good vibes and it puts me in a good mood. I don't know if you're like me, but when my hair is on point, trust me, my whole mood is just like right there. So, yeah, this hair, it gives me good vibes. I just like the texture and the shedding hasn't really been too much you know it's been minimal i do get a few like you know a few like strands off you know when i wear it but you know which i don't really mind because i don't wear this week every day i've probably worn it five times from the time i purchased it and the fifth time actually is today when you know i was making this video so i don't really wear it like that and you know the thing about synthetic wigs is that you just don't really want to make it like an everyday wig because you know it's gonna just lose its texture the curls are gonna you know go bad and you're gonna have it looking nappy so another thing or the only thing actually i would say i didn't really like about the hair is that it tangled like right here just right here and the ends too and i feel it did this because this is the longest part of the hair of the wig like the back is really really long so um you know it was just like right here so i had to brush it out and i hate brushing my wigs like i hate brushing synthetic wigs sorry i forgot to add that because you know sometimes the curl is gonna break off and it's not gonna go back to what it used to be so i always try my best just to run my fingers through my hair 
you know, to have it like down straight. So with the back, I had to, you know, untangle it. So I brushed it out, like brush it out straight. And I got my curling wand on the lowest heat. I tried, you know, just to bring back that sort of like curl to it. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, it's not too bad. It doesn't really show anyway. Like right now, you wouldn't tell I straightened it. And, you know, the curl didn't really hold much. But, you know, I'm not complaining too much. It's still a good wig. It's one of my favorite synthetic hair right now. And, you know, if you're on a budget, you know, you want something cheap, but you still want to look good, this is a good wig. If you like big hair like me, this is a good wig. So, you know, it came with the lace, so I could actually have made those baby hairs, but baby hair is enough for everyone. And for me, I honestly just don't like baby hairs so yeah i just had to pass on the baby hairs and you know i wasn't really gonna be showing this part you know that much so i just glued down my edges and i just glued down my edges and you know if i wear it in the middle um the edges are always covered as well so it really didn't matter if i had baby hairs or not because i just wanted the simple look like this so yeah, it looked pretty good, and um, for maintenance, I used a mousse, which I got from the Dollar Tree, but I don't have it right now, so I usually go on first with the mousse, and then this is what I use second, the blasting spray, so I just go on with it on top, and you know, the curls, it sort of like, you know, holds the curls, and you know, it prevents my hair from, you know, going up, flying around, or you know, when a little bit of wind blows, you know, like your hair is going to be like... But, you know, that helps it keep it in place. And the curls, as you can see, they're still pretty gorgeous, you know. For the few time I've worn it, this is actually pretty good. I still have my curls on and, you know. So, yeah. And I'm going to be doing, like, um, a lot more reviews on here because I'm always buying hair from different places. But this was my first purchase with Sam's Beauty. And I must say, I was really impressed. Shipping was quick and, you know... It was exactly what I wanted. I wanted it in another color with like the honey. You know, it was like an ombre, but it's sold out. So um, I thought I would try black, but I might try and get in another color and see how that looks. But as for this wig, I'm going to give it an 8. It's gorgeous. You know, it makes me feel gorgeous. And it just gives me all these good vibes. And it makes me feel pretty. So, if you're like me, you like big hair, this is definitely one of the wigs you just want to try. And I'm talking with this because I talk with my hands so much. So, it's just hard for me to like... So, yeah, I was holding the brush. But, anyways. So, you might just want to look forward to more video, um, more hair reviews. And, yeah, I just want to say thank you to everyone who subscribed so far. And if you just bumped into my channel... Trust me, it's going to be good. Hit the subscribe button right now. I'm going to try and post every week. One video per week for now. If I get good at it, I'm going to post two videos per week. Because, you know, I'm still learning YouTube. And trust me, it is hard work. It requires dedication, commitment, and, you know. Yeah, so I'm going to see if I can link up everything. Or oh, not everything, just the hair. But... You know, soundsbeauty.com or you just go to Google App Store or, sorry, Google Play Store or, you know, the App Store and, you know, you download the app. I think it's actually better on the app because I always use the app. But it's soundsbeauty.com. If I won't manage to put it, it's in the description, whatever. But yeah, if I don't manage to do that, just know it's soundsbeauty.com and they have so many gorgeous wigs which I want to try out soon. But this one has... You know, it's one of my favorite. I get hair from, I get some weeks from AliExpress as well. But, you know, nothing has really bit this texture. And, you know, don't let anyone tell you you can't look good in synthetic hair or in cheap stuff. You can always look good. Just stay within your means. Stick to your budget. You know, you can get, you know, the pricey hair once in a while. But, I mean, these are good occasional wigs because you don't want to have, you know, you don't want to wear it every day. You don't want to make it your everyday wig, like I said. So, this is just for the occasions, you know, photos. You just want to look glam. You're going somewhere. Get home, you take it off, you wrap it back, and, you know, you keep it safe. So, anyway, thank you for everyone who subscribed again. And if you're new, subscribe. If you have any suggestions or you have any comments, just leave them in the comment box. I'm going to see them. And if you like this video, 
please give it a thumbs up and until we see each other again bye for now it's bye